he wouldn't even try to drive the jeep. A tight squeeze. How will the jeep make it? Cross my mind. The caravan moves on. Most of the journey we make on foot. Delightful thought as I feel dusty, hungry, and tired. But instead, the trail unexpectedly and abruptly ends to the cliff, and to get across, we must use this awful looking contraption. Below, a racing torrent of icy water and rock. The Hansa River. The small cable car built for foot travelers and animals doesn't look safe to carry the jeeps. It's operated exclusively by manpower. These ropes haven't been changed for years. The knots in the rope might break at any time. by sheer miracle was a cross. This is going to make history. We have taken a jeep across this river for the first time, one of the drivers remarked. It didn't sound too reassuring. After four hours, we are safely across on the Hansa soil now. Mount Rakaposhi, the Himalayan queen covered with endless snow, 25,560 feet above the sea level towers over the valley. The first village comes into view without any warning. 